NASA is holding a press conference with reporters and on that call that's still going on, we learned that there is widespread disagreements within the agency, within NASA, about whether or not Boeing Starliner spacecraft is safe enough to bring those two NASA astronauts home, Butch Wilmore and Sonny Williams. Specifically, there's some issues with those thrusters that have been having problems for several weeks now uh, up at the International Space Station. And so now, something else that we've learned on the call, we have known for a while that NASA does have contingency plans in place, right? options, uh, other spacecrafts available to bring these astronauts home if indeed Starliner cannot. But on this call moments ago, NASA really confirmed just how far along this contingency planning process they've gone. And what we've learned is that they have pushed back the launch of the next crewed mission to the International Space Station, Crew 9. Four astronauts, including a Russian cosmonaut, that were supposed to be flying up and launching uh, in mid-August. That got pushed back to mid-September in order for NASA to maintain operational flexibility. And so what they're trying to do is have this option in place so that if they say Starliner is not safe, NASA can remove two astronauts from Crew-9, that mission, which would free up two seats for Butch and Sonny to eventually go back to Earth. But if they take that option and say that Butch and Sonny have to come home on SpaceX's Crew Dragon and not Boeing Starliner, that means that Butch and Sonny would be up at the International Space Station uh, until February of 2025. That's six months away. It's supposed to be an eight-day mission in space, roughly. Could be ex extended to uh, February 2025. That is a huge, huge increase, obviously.